this is better I'm parked let me turn off my car but the reason why I went to Starbucks is because this morning I weighed myself and I am up 30 pounds I'm breaking out um, in the last couple of months like it just didn't happen overnight but I was like okay and I was feeling kind of bloated last night I haven't been able to sleep the last two days and I think it has to do with again the carbs and all that good stuff so I should know better than this but I'm kind of at a point where like I know that my put my window down I mean up I know that my surgery is coming up and I have a positive attitude about it I really do it is natural though to feel nervous and I think that subconsciously that's how I'm feeling right now and I keep telling myself like I'm just gonna enjoy it I'm just gonna enjoy it I'm just gonna enjoy eating because when I have the surgery I'm gonna be in a very strict diet um, I don't know if I've talked about that but basically I'm gonna be on a feeding tube hopefully but while I'm at the hospital I will be able to move on to liquids I'm gonna be on liquids for I'm hoping two weeks, maybe longer. It, it all depends on how my body, you know, recovers. After that, then I'll move on to smoothies. So, like, it's a really long process that this is going to be. I'm hoping to recover within a month. I'm going to push myself to have a month recovery. But a lot of stuff is setting in, like my job situation. What am I going to do for work, money? And I'm thinking positive about all of this. I have a great support system. Love my mom, my sister. There are, oh my God, I'm going to get teary. They've been amazing. And I feel good about this but I know that subconsciously these are stressors right this is these are stressors in my life and um, I'm you know I'm walking with my head held high but I'm nervous and I think that's why I've also been like just want to go out just want to have fun want to make the best of me and I really do but um, I'm not I'm starting to like not sleep now so it's affecting me so all of that just to say that's why I went to Starbucks this morning so I can go and get a keto coffee um, and some egg bites because of course I was running late and just kind of have a lighter breakfast and you know maybe detox during the week and enjoy some carbs on the weekends leading up to the surgery um, it's about four weeks away and I didn't even say what today was but um, Wednesday May 9th <sighs> yeah that's how I'm feeling today it's been a rough rough time but I wanted to record this. I wanted to show you all that even as someone as positive as me can um, feel down. You know, look at <laughs> I keep saying that in my videos. But anyways, I'm going to go into my office for work before it gets late. Yeah, I want to see you. Smile. Say cheese. Say cheese. <laughs> <laughs> we are working on Mr. CJ's science project <laughs> or experiment actually experiment part of his science project and while you're doing it do you want to talk a little bit about it for the vlog sure why not so I'm gonna be basically like so I have three things mm -hmm. I'm gonna see if they can clean three rusty pennies mm -hmm. but no so you what are the three things oh hydrogen peroxide alcohol and Coca-Cola. <laughs> the original one. All right, fill this one. We are, so we have we've already filled up the hydrogen peroxide and the alcohol, and now we're gonna do Coke. Coke. Coca-Cola. And what time frames are you gonna use? Five minutes. Five minutes, then fifteen minutes, then th five minutes, fifteen minutes, thirty minutes, or an hour. You're doing four trials. Yeah. Now, here the. We do. do you want me to help you put it, put one of them in so they can all go in at the same time? Yes. What's the time? Oh, gotta get that phone. Oh, perfect. It's 105. So come on, put it in there so we can check at 110. Okay. Come on. So we can put them in all at the same one. time. Two, three. You know the problem with Coke is we're not going to be able to see if it's clean because it's not clear. But we'll be able to see if these start cleaning. So at 110, we've got to come. you got to get your notebook and um, start taking notes. No. Okay, yeah, go get your notebook. We'll see you guys in five minutes.
<laughs> You're so disgusting. Okay, what'd you get? I have mouthwash. I have body spray. <laughs> ah, not on my camera! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Hey, Naka, we gotta talk. No, wait, wait, you gotta warn me. Talk. Here, here open your mouth. Open your mouth. <laughs> it was hard. Cinnamon is hard. Cinnamon is like having like three things in your mouth. It's like, going oh. to my YouTube. <laughs> okay, we're gonna need to rethink First that. First of all, you know, we're gonna you need to rethink that. First of all, no, I don't need your fucking permission. Um, 